friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. I am coming back to you with another Dollar Tree WW friendly snack haul. There was some good new snacks at Dollar Tree. I actually went there for a completely different purpose and then of course I perused the snack aisle and ended up with not one, not two, but three bags of yummy WW friendly snacks from the Dollar Tree. So if you're excited for another Dollar Tree budget video, give this one a big thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, I'd love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching. I do offer personalized to you macros and calories as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching if you want to chat with me directly. Links, discounts to all my favorite healthy things, and of course my Facebook group, another community that would love Love to have you are all down in that description box. So we have a huge Dollar Tree snack haul, so let's jump in. Before I start showing you all the good stuff that I picked up from Dollar Tree, I need to put this disclaimer out there. I know that these items are not clean, whole, real foods. I know that these are processed foods, that they don't have the best ingredients, but I follow an 80-20 approach to my lifestyle, and that is 80% real whole food, 20% foods that I love, including Dollar Tree WW friendly snacks. Sometimes we're on a budget and we have to do the best that we can do to not only fuel our body, but to also stay within our budget. So now that that's out of the way, let's jump into bag number one. The thing I saw were these Mrs. Fields oatmeal cookies. Who remembers Mrs. Fields? I remember being in high school and going to the mall and stopping and picking up a yummy, warm cookie from Mrs. Fields. I don't even know if they're around anymore. Does anybody know? Do they have these in their malls? But I thought this was a really good deal. There's three cookies in here. Each cookie is 120 calories and I will be putting all of the points here on the screen for you. The only flavor they had was oatmeal raisin, which I was fine with. It's one of my favorites. I wanted to also show you that they come individually packaged and this is the size of the cookie, so not bad at all in size. That is Crunch and Munch. This is another throwback item. My husband and I love Crunch and Munch. We buy this actually pretty regularly. The caramel is our favorite. You can have two thirds of a cup for 160 calories. So if you like sweet, crunchy popcorn with a pop of peanuts, Crunch and Munch is the way to go. And I feel like this is another old school product that you just don't see advertised or promoted as much, but it's an oldie, but a goodie. Next are beef jerky packets. This particular one is the turkey jerky in cracked black pepper. These are a great option at the Dollar Tree for a more healthy, unprocessed snack. It is 90 calories in this little package and there is six grams of protein. You can eat the entire package, so it's one single serving and you can't beat it for a dollar. They had several flavors like sweet chili and cracked pepper and original. I love any type of pepper jerky, so I had to pick this one up, but Definitely check out the meat stick and jerky section of your Dollar Tree. And the last item in this bag is from the brand Bud's Best Cookies. And these are candied cookies. So it says made with coated chocolate candies, AKA like an M&M. You can have six cookies for 140 calories. There are seven servings per container. I'm gonna open it up and show you the size of the cookie. So here's the size of the cookie. And again, you get six of these for the points and the 140 calories. On to bag number two. First thing up is this Premier Protein Oat Milk Protein Shake. In a previous Dollar Tree snack video, I showed you guys the peach protein from Premier. This is the with oats and this is the blueberries and cream. There's 20 grams of protein and seven grams of fiber. 150 calories. So this is an incredible deal. At Walmart, a four pack of Premier Protein is over $8. So if you can pick them up individually for a dollar a piece, that's even a better deal than at your local Sam's Club or Costco. I've never had the one with oats. And in fact, I don't really drink Premier Protein, but I'm going to give this to my husband and I'll put here on the screen what his thoughts were. He's never had the oat milk or with oats version either. Next up is a new to me flavor of the Good Health Organic Little Cheese 
cheese fries. This is hot and spicy. Now I've bought these before a couple different flavors. These are really good and they're made with organic ingredients. You can't beat it for a dollar a bag. You can have the entire bag, which has two and a half servings for 320 calories, or it is 140 calories per serving, which is 45 fries. It's a lot of these little chips for the serving. And like I said, they're so good. And for Dollar Tree, these have pretty good ingredients. Next up are these caramel sugar-free Russell Stouffer chocolate. See that this is open and gone because I've actually been munching on these over the last couple of days, but there are three pieces per bag. So it's kind of expensive, but again, it is Russell Stouffer. One bag is one serving and it's 160 calories. I will caution you to eat these in moderation, meaning over several days because they are sugar-free and they can have that laxative effect. So I only eat one at a time. Otherwise I get the bubble guts and I just don't feel very good. Now I will give it to Russell Stouffer. These taste really good. I generally stay away from sugar-free, but I wanted to try these and purchase these so that those of you that do eat sugar-free, this is a great chocolate option at Dollar Tree. Next up are the Fruit Gusher Fruit Snacks. I've never seen Fruit Gushers at the Dollar Tree, so there's four packs in here. It is the Strawberry Splash flavor. There's 90 calories per little pouch of fruit snacks. Now, I'm assuming that these are about the standard fruit snack pouch. Yep. So here is what the little pouch looks like. Fruit snacks actually aren't generally too bad in points. Now these have a little more calories than like the Mott's. I think the Mott's is 60 calories and three points, but of course points will be here on the screen. But if you love Gushers, this is a great affordable way to get four little packages perfect for lunch. Also had a couple products from the Lance brand. Now this is a name brand that you can find at your local grocery store, but I thought that this was a really good deal. These are the lemon cream cookies. There are six packs of four cookies per pack. So basically 24 cookies in here individually packed into four cookie packages, which is really nice so you don't overeat them. One pack is only 150 calories. So I thought that wasn't too bad for four cookies. And again, because it's pre-portioned, you're less likely to overeat them. And I love lemon anything. I know that Troy will eat these as well because there's no chocolate. So I'll be actually popping these into his lunch. But again, it's a great pre-portioned sweet snack. Here's the other Lance product that I picked up. So these are the Captain's Wafers Sandwich Crackers. I picked up the cream cheese and chai flavor. That sounds so good. And again, there are six packs, four crackers per individual pack, and they're 130 calories a piece. So again, these are great pre-packaged options. You avoid overeating and they're great to throw in a lunch or to take with you on the go for a quick snack. And the last item in bag number two is this Paleo Nut Mix from Nature's Garden. I always stop by the nuts or the trail mix section because it's a good option. It's a healthy snack from Dollar Tree. These are no exception. The ingredients in these are just the nuts. It is cooked with peanut and or canola oil. So that's really the only not clean ingredient in here. But this bag has three servings. A serving of these is one ounce and it's 170 calories, but you do get six grams of protein per ounce as well as some health fats. So if you're trying to stay away from the more processed snacks at the Dollar Tree and you're still on a budget, these are a great way to go. They had a keto one as well. I didn't pick that one up because it was 200 calories per serving and much more points than this one. But just kind of heads up, what's in this is peanuts, cashews, almonds, walnuts, and hazelnuts. So all it is is a nut mix. And I thought this whole package for a dollar three servings, got to do it. And the final bag, bag number three. First up is Skinny Pop. So I was really excited to see these big bags. This is the white cheddar. They did also have butter and I think one other flavor at my Dollar Tree. The entire bag is one serving. So again, that's nice. It's pre-portioned out. You can't overeat. It's 150 calories per serving. So this is great. Again, keep it in your car, your gym bag, your desk drawer, take it on the go and it prevents you from overeating because it's a single serve bag. Also, they carried the Angie's Boom Chicka Pop and this is the Sweet and Salty Kettle Corn. It actually has more than one serving in the bag. There is two servings per bag. Two cups is a serving for 140 calories or the entire bag is 320. So you can share this with a friend or what I will do often is just weigh out one serving and bag it up individually and then keep the other serving in the package that it came in. And that way I'm not tempted to overeat. But even if you did, 320 calories for this big bag of popcorn is not too bad. And of course, I'll put the points here on the screen for a single serving as well as the entire bag. Next are these Just Crisp 
crispy dried carrots with nothing added. The only ingredient on this is carrots. So cleanest foods you're probably gonna find at the Dollar Tree. It is 60 calories for the bag. There's two grams of protein. I would count this as zero points because there's no added sugar. Now, technically I'm sure there's points. I'll put it here on the screen because it has 60 calories and seven grams of sugar, none of which are added. So they're natural sugar in a carrot. So for me, I would count this as zero points. So I think it's a great way to get in vegetables and satisfy that crunch. Next up is from Munch Rites. Now I have purchased several of their products in previous videos. Really, really like this brand. These are pretty clean for Dollar Tree. This is the barbecued baked puffs. I've never tried the barbecued, but I'm pretty excited about it. Three servings per bag. Each serving is one ounce or 140 calories, or the entire bag is 430 calories. Ingredients aren't a hundred percent clean. There is vegetable oil in here, as well as a couple other ingredients that aren't perfect, but you know what? It's a dollar for a bag of less processed, less unhealthy snacks, and who doesn't love a good barbecue flavored anything? It'd be a great substitute for a traditional barbecue flavored chip. Next up are these strawberry wafer cookies. Now, I have repurchased these several times. I think this is my third or fourth the pack. Troy loves these. I've been putting these in his lunch. And what's great about these is they're 130 calories per package. And it is two of these little packages. So it's both rows for the points and calories. I think six of the little wafer cookies for 130 calories. You can't beat it. And they're not overly sweet, but they have a good strawberry flavor. And like I said, Troy loves these. These will go into his lunch. I think they had vanilla and potentially chocolate as well. But if you want a lot for your calories or points, this is a good option. And lastly, I have from Werther, their sugar-free caramel coffee. Another really good sugar-free option. There's two and a half servings per bag. It's five pieces per serving and it's only 40 calories or you can eat the entire bag for 100 calories. So this would be great to just have to enjoy. It takes a while to eat one of these. You kind of have to suck on it, not chew it, so it lasts a while. So it's a great way to get in that little bit of sweetness, have it last a while, and really you can have one piece for under 10 calories or five pieces for 40 calories or the points here on the screen. So I think this is a great option. You can keep these in your purse for those emergencies emergency where you need a little sweet or you can keep it in your desk drawer and again you can't beat it for a dollar. So that is my Dollar Tree WW friendly calorie friendly snack haul. There were so many new good things. I love my Dollar Tree. The one closest to my house is the best that we have in town. They have the biggest food section overall and I find that they rotate out their snack options quite frequently. So in your area try to find the best Dollar Tree that carries the best options and check back pretty regularly for new and exciting finds. So if you enjoyed another WW friendly Dollar Tree snack haul, give this video a big thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, of course, I'd love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. Don't forget to check out the description box down below for nutrition coaching, as well as links and discounts to my favorite things. And of course, my Facebook group, don't forget to head on over and join us there. Thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next one.